Disclaimer, the author does not claim ownership of the documents, images, audio, music, video and other materials used in this lesson. They remain the property of the original creators, who are mentioned in the acknowledgement section of this lesson. The said materials are used for educational purposes only. Thank you very much. Installing and Configuring Computer Systems MELX L01 Assemble Computer Hardware Codes TLE underscore IACSS 9-12 ICCS IAE 28 Supplementary Learning Materials SLM Number 1 How Computers Work Content Standard The learners demonstrate an understanding of concepts and principles in installing and configuring computer systems. Performance Standard the learners shall be able to install and configure computer systems based on established procedures and system requirements. Objectives At the end of the lesson, 80% of the students will be able to describe computer hardware, explain how computers work, information processing cycle, name the different hardware components, input, processing output, and storage devices, describe the function of each part. What's new? What is a computer? A computer is an electronic machine. It accepts input, processes data, produces output, and stores data. The movement of data can go on and on like a cycle. This set of steps is called the information processing cycle. Hardware is the part of the computer that you can see or touch. Some hardware parts are inside the computer. You can only see them if you open or remove their cover. Hardware parts that are outside the computer and are attached to it by wires or cables are called peripheral devices. Data are raw facts about things, events, or activities that are captured, recorded, and stored on the computer. They can be in a form of words, numbers, or pictures. Data become information when they have been arranged or organized to be of use and to have meaning to the user. Data entered into the computer undergo several steps before they become meaningful and usable information. The steps they go through form the information processing cycle. Information Processing Cycle Input, Processing, Output, and Storage Devices Input device is any hardware device that sends data to a computer, allowing you to interact with and control it. Processing device is any device inside a computer that interprets and manipulates incoming data during this stage. Output device is any hardware device used to send data from a computer to another device or user. Storage device is any type of computing hardware that is used for storing, porting, or extracting data files and objects. Computer inside and out, input device. Input is the data entered into the computer. It can be in the form of words, symbols, numbers, or pictures. The word input is easy to remember if you separate it and then say it backward. Input, input, put in, an input device changes the input into a form that the computer can process. Example of input devices, keyboard, a computer keyboard is one of the primary input devices used with a computer. Similar to an electric typewriter, a keyboard is composed of buttons that create letters numbers, and symbols, as well as other functions. Pointing devices, an input device used to move the pointer, cursor, on screen, mouse, a computer mouse is a handheld hardware input device that controls a cursor in a GUI, graphical user interface, and can move and select text, icons, files, and folders on your computer. Touch screen, a display screen that is sensitive to the touch of a finger or stylus. 
used in myriad applications, including ATM machines, retail point-of-sale terminals, car navigation, and industrial controls. The touch screen became wildly popular for smartphones and tablets. Light pen, a light-sensitive stylus wired to a video terminal used to draw pictures or select menu options. The user brings the pen to the desired point on screen and presses the pen button to make contact. Digitizer tablet, a graphics drawing tablet used for sketching new images or tracing old ones. Also called a graphics tablet, the user contacts the surface of the device with a wired or wireless pen or pen. Often mistakenly called a mouse, the puck is officially the tablet person. Scanning devices use laser beam and reflected light to turn images of text, drawings, or photos into digital form. The image can then be processed by a computer, displayed on a monitor, stored on a storage device, or communicated to another computer. Example of scanning devices, scanner or optical scanner is a hardware input device that optically reads an image and converts it into a digital signal. For example, a scanner may be used to convert a printed picture, drawing, or document, hard copy, into a digital file that can be edited on a computer. Barcode reader, a barcode is a set of lines of different widths and sizes representing data that help identify the scanned object when read. Barcodes are often used to help organize and index information or prices about an object. Barcode readers are photoelectric scanners that change the barcode into a form the computer can process. Digital camera is a hardware device that takes photographs and stores the image as data on a memory card. Unlike an analog camera, which exposes film chemicals to light, a digital camera uses digital optical components to register the intensity and color of light and converts it into pixel data. Webcam is a camera that connects to a computer. It captures either still pictures or motion video, and with the aid of software, can transmit its video on the internet in real time. Processing device, computers are processed or change data into meaningful information in many ways. With computers, you can do calculations, arrange lists of words or numbers, create letters or pictures, and draw objects and graphs. All data is processed in the computer's central processing unit, CPU. Example of processing devices, system unit, the main part of a microcomputer, sometimes called the chassis. It includes the following parts, motherboard, microprocessor, memory chips, buses, ports, expansion slots, and cards. Motherboard or mainboard or system board, the main circuit board of a computer. It contains all the circuits and components that run the computer. Central processing unit, CPU, the processor is the main brain or heart of a computer system. It performs all of the instructions and calculations that are needed and manages the flow of information through a computer. Power supply unit, PSU, installed in the back corner of the PC case, next to the motherboard. It converts 120 watt standard house power, into DC voltages that are used by other components in the PC. Expansion bus, a bus is a data pathway between several hardware components inside or outside a computer. It does not only connect the parts of the CPU to each other, but also links the CPU with other important hardware, example of expansion bus, AGP slot, memory slot, and PCI slot.
adapters, printed circuit boards, also called interface cards, that enable the computer to use a peripheral device for which it does not have the necessary connections or circuit boards. They are often used to permit upgrading to a new different hardware, example of adapter card, sound card, video card, and an IC or LAN card. Output device are peripheral devices used by the computer so the processed data could be displayed, heard, or printed. Example of output devices. Monitor, it displays information in visual form, using text and graphics. The portion of the monitor that displays the information is called the screen or video display terminal types of monitors, CRT monitor, LCD monitor, and LED monitor. LCD projectors utilize two sheets of polarizing material with a liquid crystal solution between them. An electric current passed through the liquid causes the crystals to align so that light cannot pass through them. Each crystal, therefore, is like a shutter, either allowing light to pass through or blocking the light. Smart board, a type of display screen that has a touch-sensitive transparent panel covering the screen, which is similar to a touch screen. A printer is a device that accepts text and graphic output from a computer and transfers the information to paper. Types of printer, dot matrix printer, inkjet or bubble jet printer, laser printer, LCD and LED printer, line printer, and thermal printer. Speakers used to play sound. They may be built into the system unit or connected with cables. Speakers allow you to listen to music and hear sound effects from your computer. Example, speaker, headphones, and headset or earphone. A storage device is any type of computing hardware that is used for storing, porting, or extracting data files and objects. Storage devices can hold and store information both temporarily and permanently. They may be internal or external to a computer, server, or computing device. Example of storage devices, hard disk drive, HDD, also known as hard drive, is a magnetic storage device that is installed inside the computer. The hard drive is used as permanent storage for data. In a Windows computer, the hard drive is usually configured as the C drive and contains the operating system and applications. Read-only memory (ROM) is a type of storage medium that permanently stores data on personal computers, PCs, and other electronic devices, meaning it holds data even when the power is on or off. Random Access Memory RAM. RAM is volatile memory, which means that the information temporarily stored in the module is erased when you restart or shut down your computer. When the computer is shut down, the memory is cleared until the process begins again. Volatile memory can be changed, upgraded, or expanded easily by users. There are two types of RAM memory, static RAM and dynamic RAM. A USB flash drive is a device used for data storage that includes a flash memory and an integrated universal serial bus USB, interface. They derive the power to operate from the device to which they are connected, typically a computer, via the USB port. Diskette is a random access, a removable data storage medium that can be used with personal computers. The term usually refers to the magnetic medium housed in a rigid plastic cartridge measuring 3.5 inches square and about 2 millimeters thick. It can store up to 1.44 megabytes MB of data. Thank you for watching. Do not forget 
to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell icon. And also don't forget to like, comment and share. See you next time. Keep safe, and God bless.